Hey guys, I just want to pop on here real quick with you today. So this is something that I don't do, and I just collected myself from from uh, prayer time. I guess what I said, just seeing Jesus. So, like I said, bear with me as I try to tell you exactly what happened today. Um, as you see on the thing, it says, "I just seen Jesus," and this is what He said. So, um, bear with me. Like I said, I'm going to do my best to 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 try to get through this because, like I said, I just collected myself and. <laughs> And uh, it's phenomenal. So uh, I'll just start at the beginning. I was praying today. And as I was praying, I sensed the power of God come into, come into the church. And I just felt, and the Lord speak to me, just to kneel down and uh, <laughs> just kneel down and not say anything. Just kneel down. And so I did. I kneeled down at the pew. As you can see, I'm in the church, in the church right now. And that's all I did. I didn't get any words out I just knelt down and I felt the presence of God come into the place and as I felt the presence of God come into place in this in, into this place where I'm at right now where I'm seated my goodness Jesus walks in and as Jesus walked in I, I fell down at his feet and I can't explain the, the glory. I can't explain the love. I can't explain the peace that that took place. And, and you know, I'll just ask you to share this if you would, because this is so, so, so important. This is exactly, you know, what people need to hear right now. And so I just fell there at his feet. I mean, just to just to say that I was in the presence of Jesus, that he loved me so much that he, you know, that he was willing to spend time, time with me. And he walked in and and I just laid there at his feet and just started weeping and I couldn't yeah, I couldn't even stop stop weeping like I said I'm going to try to do my best to get past this and so as I was weeping he, I just felt the love and I just want to tell you first and foremost guys that Jesus loves you Jesus loves you no matter what you're going through no matter what you've done no no matter what that's what I felt the the presence of God was so powerful Jesus was standing in the room and I I couldn't even get up I couldn't even get up and then all of a sudden he picked me up and as he picked me up, I, I was sitting with Jesus and he was speaking to me and, and he said this, we were sitting together and he said, Matt, he said, I love you and I love everyone in this world. And so I sat there and he said, go and tell people that I love them and I'm coming back very, very, very soon. And so today I just want to tell you that, that Jesus Christ is coming back soon. Guys, this is not a game. He, he, <laughs> he literally sat with me. And spoke to me. He doesn't care what denomination you are. He doesn't care if you're Catholic. He doesn't care if you're Methodist, Baptist, Pentecostal. It doesn't matter. The only thing that matters to him is, my gosh, he loves you. And I, I can't explain, like I said, Lord, help me. I, I can't explain the presence of God. Literally, Jesus walked into the room and said, I'm coming back very, 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 very soon. I'm coming back very, 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 very soon. And he says, get ready. And I want to tell you that today that, listen, no matter what you've done, please, no matter what you've done, come to Jesus. Listen, <laughs> and, and don't get me wrong. I, you know, I, I've preached and been in ministry all my life. And I, and I knew, G, you know, I know that Jesus is real. But after today, he's, he, he's more real than I've ever experienced in my life. Like I said, I, I'm, I'm having trouble to, to even fathom what happened but i was i fell at jesus's feet and he picked me up in the in the love that he has for each and every one of you the loves that he had the love that he has for each and every one of you you know the only thing i could do was lay there and weep and weep and weep and he picked me up and he said matt go and tell my people tell my people that i love them and i'm coming back very soon and so guys like i said i just want to tell you today that god loves you god loves you jesus loves you no matter what you've done in your life, no matter how bad it looks in your life, listen, don't believe the lies of the enemy. He loves you. Jesus is real. He's coming back very, very, very soon. And the peace that, that, that was around him too, as well as I was sitting there and just, <laughs> just basking in his presence. I mean, I can't explain to you how amazing it truly was that Jesus literally walked into the room. And guys, like I said, time is running short. We are living in the last days, <laughs> uh, uh, the last days, in the final hours of the last days. And so, like I said, he came in and he said, Matt, just tell my people that I love them. Tell my people that I love them so much that I died for them. And I want to tell you today that Jesus loves you so much that he died for you. If you were the only one 
that was on this earth, he would have died for you today. He would have died for you today. That is how much he loves you. He took his, your sin up on the cross and he loved you that much. And I can't explain. Like I said, I can't fathom what I just experienced, the love of Christ, that, that as I was sitting there, literally embracing him, give, <laughs> literally him embracing me. And he said, Matt, time is short. My people are coming. Just tell them. Just tell them. Like I said, he doesn't, it doesn't matter. It doesn't matter what denomination you are. It doesn't matter, <laughs> you know, how dirty you think you are or anything like that. Jesus loves you. <laughs> are you ready? And that's it. And I want to tell you who's coming back very, 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 very soon. Like I said, you know, God help me because I can't explain what happened. I can't. I can't. But I'm telling you, Jesus is real. And how wonderful it was to see the King of Kings enter into the same room with me as I was just laying there, just, <laughs> you know, like, like so just almost like you read in some of the Bible stories, you know, the things that were real, that you were just laying there at Jesus's feet and just weeping uncontrollably because you were in the presence of the King of Kings. And I want to tell you today that he's real, that he loves you. And if you've never given your life to Christ, now is the time because he is coming back very, very, very soon. Very, 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 very soon. And that was literally on the only thing that he shared with me. Matt, go and tell my people that I love them. I don't care what denomination they are. I don't care what they've been through in life. But if they accept me as their Lord and Savior, then they will make it into heaven. And I want to tell you today, please, people, please, everyone that is watching, be sure that you're ready. Be sure that you're ready because he's coming back very soon. And like I said, I only want to pop on here just for a moment. Please, you know, share this broadcast. Because I just, like I said, I can't give you the words of what just happened. Except that I was literally in the presence of Jesus. Come be with me and let me tell you what I need you to do next. And so if you're saved, please tell people about Jesus. That's it. I don't care what your theology is. I don't care what your doctrine is. It's all about Jesus. That's it. It's all about Jesus. And he said, Matt, I'm coming back very soon. Tell my people. And so I want to tell you today, guys, Jesus loves you. I cannot describe the love that I felt when I was in his presence, when he was standing just literally right here, sitting right here with me. You can call me crazy if you want to, but I'm telling you, he was literally sitting right here with me. He picked me up off my face and he said, Matt, as we were sitting there together, he said, I'm coming back soon. That's the only thing I can, I, I can say to you. I, I'm still kind of a mess. I'm still shaking on the inside. But I want to tell you that the Bible says that, you know, behold, I stand at the door knocking anyone that opens the door. I will come in. Come and hey, come to Jesus. Come to Jesus. Like I said, you know, I'm sick and tired of denominations fighting because it's literally all about Jesus Christ. That's it. It's all about souls. It's all about seeing people come into the kingdom of heaven. And so if you don't know Jesus today, you need to know him. You need to know him. You need to give your life to him. Open that door today because like I said, he sat there and he said, Matt, you are living literally in the final hours of the last days. Tell my people that I'm coming and that I love them. That was it. And I'm telling you guys, the love, the love, <laughs> the love that he has for you. Like I said, you know, I, I, I knew, you know, I knew Jesus was real. But after today, like, I don't even know what to say. My goodness, the love that he has for you. He loves you so much. He loves you so much. No matter how messed up you are, he still loves you. My goodness. And I just want to tell you today that he set me down and he said, Matt, tell my people that I'm coming soon. Be ready. Be ready today. Like I said, I don't want to take too much time because I don't even know. It. I can't even get the words out, but be ready. Christ is coming back very, 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 very soon. And it's time that you're ready. Hallelujah. Glory to God. He loves you guys. He loves you so much. And I can't, I can't put it into words. It's just something that you have to experience. And the greatest miracle that you can experience is salvation through Jesus Christ. And like I've seen, I've seen Jesus. People may call me crazy or whatever, but he was literally sitting right here next to me. Saying, man, I love them so much that I died for them. That I died for them. I've never had an experience like that before where the King of Kings walked into the same room as me. And as I was worshiping literally at his feet, he picked me up and said, Matt, let me talk to you. And he said, Matt, time's short. 
I'm coming back. And it wasn't like he was coming back with a vengeance. He was coming back and he said, tell my people that I love them. And it's time to get ready. And so today, please share this broadcast. I'm telling you, Jesus is real. Like I said, he literally sat beside of me and spoke to me for a moment. And the only thing I could do was just weep uncontrollably. Weep uncontrollably. That's the only thing that I could do as I tried to listen as best as I could. And he said, Matt, just tell them that I'm real and that I love them. And it's time for them to come home. It's time for them to come to me. And so, guys, I don't care even if you're in a different religion. Jesus is the one that is real. Jesus is real. Every other God is dead. And so come to him today. He loves you so much that he died for you. He died for your sins. Again, he doesn't care what your, the skin color is. He doesn't care what your, <laughs> what your denomination is. It doesn't matter about that. It just matters if you know him and if he's living in the inside of you. So please share this broadcast. Jesus is coming soon and know that he loves you so much. And I can't put it into words how much he loves you. It's even more amazing than any mother's love, any father's love, anything like that. Like I said, I, I can't explain it. It's t- <laughs> I can't explain what happened. But please, guys, Jesus is coming back. Give your life to him if you haven't already. Because I don't want you to go to a devil's hell. I want to see you in heaven with me one day. Amen. Hallelujah. So I love you guys. Share the crap out of this broadcast because people need to know that Jesus is real. And like I said, he was literally sitting right here next to me picked me up off the floor and he said Matt tell him I'm coming we are living in the final hours of the last days do you know him today he loves you come to him amen I love you guys I just wanted to share that experience with you please share the broadcast tell everybody that Jesus is real and that he's coming back very soon